Work is well underway on the new Esther Simplot Park right next to the whitewater feature on the Boise River, but crews have dug up something unexpected under the surface. What they found could change the whole project. Jake Melder reports. The city of Boise has partnered with the Simplot family to turn a dirt lot in the middle of the city into a world-class park. But as crews broke ground, the site's history as a place of industrial use became evident, and the waste of past generations has put a bump in the road. Construction on what will become the Esther Simplot Park has hit a snag. As crews dug out massive pits for the future ponds, a dirty secret was revealed. It was the kind of material that you wouldn't want your kids playing in. This black soil is filled with petroleum, most likely seepage from the lot's previous tenants. What we had to do is cut it out, basically. Um, we had to dig it all out, and that's the pile you see there. The Department of Environmental Quality says the polluted dirt is not toxic, but the city isn't taking chances. Trucks will spend the next month hauling 100,000 cubic yards of dirt to the landfill. We just ask that if people see these trucks, they're carrying a lot of dirt, it's a heavy load, that they're cautious around them. The oil-soaked dirt may also change the park's final design. City leaders and the Simplot family are currently looking at the overall impact and weighing their options. The city did what we needed to do, the right thing, um, to get that material out of there. Because ultimately, still, we're still going to have a beautiful, you know, about a 55-acre park here. Yeah. And this is just a small uh, hiccup in the road. Despite the weeks crews will need to clear out the bad dirt, the city says things are still on schedule. The park will open up sometime next spring.